no, look at this dude. Come on, Ah, it's Gore, one of the greatest masked bands ever. One of the greatest masked bands ever. It might be illegal to wear a mask soon in uh, Hong Kong, you heard? So, uh, shit, is, uh, shit is getting foggy in here. I can't even fucking see, man. Fucking, how do you wear one of these things? How do you wear one of these things with glasses? You can't because your eyes are all fogged up. But my glasses are fake anyway, so it doesn't matter, right? So, let's look at, uh, see if I can see what the hell I'm doing over here. So, oh, you know what? Let's start off with a cute, um... So this is a great video. Watch this, man. Again, animals, man, they love you. Animals absolutely love you. They do. This is Teddy, one of our North American porcupines. Teddy, come here. Would you like some corn on the cob? <gasps> what is that? Oh, my goodness. You have it? Don't drop it. Here's Teddy and his corn on the cob. He loves corn. Teddy, Teddy? Can you share your coin with me? Can I have it? Yeah. No. Let me have it. You won't share? Oh, really? Okay, you have your cord on the top now. Oh, my. <laughs> That's Teddy the Porcupine. He's got 11 million views. God damn, Teddy's doing something right, man. All he's got to do is eat corn, and he's got 11 million views. So, so costumes, masks, right? Is that what we're talking about? Illegal to wear a mask in Hong Kong, you heard? So thousands of uh, thousands protesters, I can't do it because <laughs> my glasses are fogged up. I can't see what I'm doing. Fucking unbelievable. Ah, so thousands protested um, mask ban at Hong Kong leader as Hong Kong leader tightened stance. So this is real. This is serious. Right, a serious issue right here. So in Hong Kong, it's no longer legal to wear a one of these masks out in the public. Right, <clears throat> mask protesters streamed into the streets in Hong Kong on Friday after the city's embattled leader invoked rarely used emergency powers to ban masks at rallies in a, in a hardening of the government's stance after four months of anti-government demonstrations. So this shit isn't working. Immediately defying the ban set to take effect Saturday. <clears throat> All right, so it's not Saturday yet, tomorrow. Thousands of protesters crammed streets into the central business districts shouting, Hong Kong, resist. Ah, so, uh, so they tried this. Remember they tried this with the Gilets Jaunes? The Gilets Jaunes in France, uh, this is back in January, two, uh, January of this year, 2019. France's National Assembly has approved the law banning the, wa the wearing of masks at protests in, and another to ban specific people taking part in rallies. Wearing a mask could now result in a one-year prison sentence at, uh, and five, five, 15,000 euro fine. <laughs> they're, they're, they're protesting because they're poor, and then you're going to fine them 15,000 euro as if you're going to get your money. 
France has been, well, you put them into slavery. You say, okay, you got to work it off. You got to work it off at a, you know, a dollar an hour, a, a euro per hour. France has seen weekly protests by the Gilets Jaunes Yellow Vest movement with isolated pockets of violence. Right? So that's where they got the idea, idea from, right? So, so let's look at, let's listen to Miss Lam, Hong Kong leader Miss Lam in her own words. Miss Lam, speak. As the current situation has clearly given rise to a state of serious public danger, the chief executive in council decided at a special meeting this morning to invoke the power under the emergency regulations ordinance and make a new regulation in the name of prohibition on face covering regulation, which is essentially an anti-mask law, something which has already been introduced in a number of jurisdictions around the world and discussed here in Hong Kong. We believe that the new law will create a deterrent effect against masked violent protesters and rioters and will assist the police in its law enforcement. It's an important thing, man. It's an important move, right? Because, because the first of all, the protests are valid. The protests are to fight for their freedoms and, and loss of civil liberties. Like, I don't know, being able to protest, for example, right? So this is it's so important in Hong Kong that they're losing their freedoms. They did beat the extradition law for now, meaning that if you commit a crime or some kind of thought crime in Hong Kong, you could be extradited to mainland China, Beijing, and fall under communist law, meaning that speaking out against the government is uh, punishable by prison, right? Saying, oh, I, I hate this place. I think this, I think this government sucks. I, I got a better idea. That's illegal in, in China. Huh? So Hong Kong, it is not illegal yet, and that's what they're fighting for. So now they're slowly losing their civil liberties. Now, could, could a, you know, like, I don't know, could a could a, a masked a mask uh, law actually work to do the things that the woman said they were going to do? No, the masking is designed to assist the cops in arresting people. It doesn't de-escalate the violence. It doesn't um, make for a safer place. It makes it for a safer, more. Uh, uh, expedient uh, place for police. So look at some of the riots. Do the police have a, a legitimate argument in trying to identify the, the, the attackers and stop the violence against them? Of course they do. But is it going to work? Hell fucking no. So here's some good footage. Here's what I love. What, I love the when the police get an ass kicking. Here's, this is definitely definitely an ass kicking. Watch. Police get a royal fucking ass kicking on this one. I hear bang, oh motherfucker, banging them with that. Sticks. Ah. And they're shooting, the police are shooting. They got guns drawn, you saw that? One, two, shooting up in the air. He shot up in the air. He blew around off in the air, you saw that? Ah, oh, you got, you got your head cracked open. Too fucking bad. Too fucking bad, Chang. Shit happens, man, right? Good for the protesters. Good for them, man. Fuck you. You gotta fight back, man. You can't you can't just like you can't just I mean where did, where's the right stop, you know? Where does where does all this shit stop? So so the mass protesters stra uh, streamed into the streets in Hong Kong. 
Uh, Lamb said at an afternoon news conference that the mask ban imposed under a colonial era ordinance uh, that was la- last used over half a decade ago targets violent protesters and rioters. Uh, it targets the people that are causing the the uh, revolution. This is revolution, revolution in the air. So I, I don't have much more to say about this. You know, other than, let's listen to some gore, motherfucker. I love these guys. We played with these guys. Barney Rubble and the Constable opened up for gore. Good friends. Good guys. Good guys. The, the, the singer, the fat guy with the two dicks, he's new. The other guy died. Odorous Urungus, the uh, original singer. Uh, he's good. Like like We're good then. Yeah. In a cage. Go to the lions. Walk the second page. Yeah, 